The last two trig functions are the least important, and I'm going to kind of rush through them quickly. The cosecant is one divided by the sine. When you memorize these, notice that the cos do not go together. That is to say, you might think the cosecant would be one divided by the cosine, but that is not the case. The cosecant is one divided by the sine. Once again, there's an infinite list of numbers that aren't in the domain. Any number of the form k pi, where k is an integer. The range of the cosecant is the same as the range of the secant. Finally, we'll introduce the cotangent, whereas the tangent is the sine over the cosine. The cotangent is the reciprocal of that, the cosine over the sine. Because this has division by sine, just like this does, the domains are the same. And the range of the cotangent, like the range of the tangent, is all real numbers.